Hey guys, here for another Android video. In this video, I want to share with you guys a very cool live wallpaper I've been using for almost more than a week already. It's called Muse. And it's a live wallpaper, and like you see, I have it installed on my tablet and on my phone as well. I uninstalled the app and installed it again. That way, I could show you guys how it works from the beginning. Uh, when you install it and and act and launch the app, you're gonna get this nice um, screen. You press activate. When you press activate, you're automatically gonna get the settings and set wallpaper feature you always get when you install a, a live wallpaper. And if you click settings, it'll take you to the app itself uh, from here you have a couple options you have this option right here that lets you um, uh, see a new painting every day this is the one that's here by default uh, you can choose that or you can either let me go back here or you could either choose your photos my photos and from here if you choose here you click there uh, from here you can come control the, the time your photos uh, rotate or change or shuffle uh, like you see I got it every six hours but if you want you can put it every three hours if you click right here you will be able to choose a picture from your gallery or from any other app that you have and you would from here you would add pictures randomly yourself and then they would uh, um, they would rotate and do the musee awesome feature that it does um, here you can also the great thing about this app is that it's an open source app and a lot of people been making plugins um, compatible with this app for example I have a a plugin here which is called cast for muse what that what this one does is that it, it gives you photos from Chromecast um, those photos that you see if you have a Chromecast and when the Chromecast is on idle uh, you can see um, awesome beautiful wallpapers in the background so this um, uh, plugin gives you wallpapers that appear in the Chromecast and I love them so that's why I chose this one for my phone and from here of course every plugin has a different settings for like for example this one you could put it uh, to change um, every hour you could control it by hours and minutes or Wi-Fi only and that's it whatever you want um, and once you do that you go back you go back um, wait I didn't I, I didn't set it as a wallpaper let's go ahead and set it as a wallpaper uh, once you set it let's go ahead here you can see the images that are of, that's gonna be your wallpaper if you click back 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 like you see, this is how the wallpaper is gonna look. It look it's gonna look blurry. Like you see right there, it's gonna look blurry. But when you double tap on it, it you automatically the photo automatically um, focuses, and you can see the image, the beautiful image, which looks very very cool. Look at that. Um, if anything, let's say you want to change that uh, that uh, wallpaper, you could easily go back to the app itself. Let's go back here to the app. Uh, here you see the wallpaper and you also see the name of the wallpaper. You also see the person that made the picture. You can click next and you can go ahead, click and go to another image like you see right there. If you keep on going, it'll just go, keep on going forever. Um, here you go also and customize when you choose right here, advance, uh, you can control the, um, the, uh, the dim. You can control if you want it a little bit darker or if you want it a little bit more brighter there uh, here you can also control the blurriness if you want it uh, less blurry the image less blurry or like that I just leave it like that um, here this is a very cool feature if you leave it if you leave this checked what's gonna happen is that every time there's a new image uh, you are automatically gonna get a a notification here like you see right there you're gonna get a notification with the image that has been changed on your phone and that's a very cool feature too so if you click back 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 now your wallpaper has changed if you double tap you can see the image right there very very cool now let's go ahead to the tablet so you guys can see um, I'm, on the tablet I have another plugin which is let me see which one is it I think it's the 500 pixel this one 500 px this is an awesome source for beautiful images and like you see the the every plugin has its different um, settings or menu um, here I could choose from popular I could choose from any category that I want here for example if I go I could go ahead and choose um, uh, I could go ahead and choose um, underwater uh, or 
urban exploration. Every I could go ahead and select it to choose change every hour. And from here, I could select now hide adult content and update on Wi-Fi only. When I click back, it's already set up and you're done. So when you click back here, like you see, you see an awesome, beautiful image. And when you double tap, look at that beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Now you see this one since it's a big image on the tablet for me it looks a lot better because it the whole image takes the whole screen and you don't it doesn't you don't need the image to be um, um rotating or or sliding every time you slide your wallpaper your home screens um of course you could go always here to the app store to the google play store and search music when you search music you're gonna see all the plugins available uh, and it's very very easy to choose one for example national geographic music if i want to click on that one um it, it, you can see the description here you can go ahead and install it let's go ahead and install it okay so once it's installed, you can go Joe, you can go ahead back to your wallpaper, back to your wallpaper settings. Uh, let's go ahead and search for Musee again, Musee over here. Let's go ahead to customize. And let's go ahead and choose another source. Like you see right there, National Geographic now is selected here. Uh, from here, let's see what settings is, is available. Uh, this one right here says uh, refresh every 180 uh, minutes. That's not bad, okay. Uh, during Wi-Fi only, okay. Doesn't matter because this is a tablet. This has no G, um, um, data. Um, you go ahead and when you click back, there you go. The, now you can see descriptions of the images that you're getting from uh, National Geographic, which is awesome. I don't think you're gonna go bad with images from, from them because they have beautiful image per day. And like you see, you see the name of the, look at that, Cloudfish, the, the name of the picture and the description of what it's about. Very, very cool and click back and that's it. Double tap, awesome. So, and the great thing is that this is totally free um, and the plugins are totally free and it, it it's a live wallpaper, but it doesn't really um, burns your battery because it's, you don't see nothing. You don't see nothing, um, you know, changing and, and blinking on the screen or anything like that. The only thing it's live is because you double tap and it um, it, um, it focuses and it goes back to blurriness. And that's the only thing it has from a live wallpaper and it also changes on its own. So you're randomly gonna have different wallpapers depending on the time you set. And that's it guys, so thanks for watching. That was it, I had to share this app with you guys. It's called Museum, it's totally free. I'll leave a link in my description so you guys can go ahead and try it. Thanks for watching guys, till next time.